At the end of this ruler, there's an idiot. I have a question. What? In which end? Why are you sleeping in class? Your voice is so sweet, ma'am. That's why I'm falling asleep. Why isn't anyone else sleeping? Because they're not listening to you. Why didn't you come to school yesterday? I was sick. You're lying. Nope, I was sick of you and the school. Tell me the name of this bird by looking at its legs. I don't know. You failed. What's your name? Look at my legs and you'll know. Why are you late? My dad's in the hospital. Is your dad still in the hospital? Yeah, he's a doctor. I'm gonna ask you a question and your answer should be quick, okay? Okay. Two plus two. Quick. I'm not marking your test. Why? Your writing is too ugly. Looks like my writing and your face have something in common. You failed the test. And you failed to educate me. Are you talking back to me? Yes, that's how a conversation works. <gasps> Can you repeat what you taught today in class? Why? Was it that interesting? No, I just can't fall asleep. <laughs> Why do we drink water? Do you know the answer, Luke? Because we can't eat it. What's the chemical formula for water? H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O What are you talking about? Yesterday you said it's H2O Luke, your essay on my dog is the exact same as your sister's Yeah, and? Did you just copy hers? No, we have the same dog Why are you praying in my class? My mom told me I should pray before sleeping From all this talking, I assume you're done? From all this complaining, I assume you're single would you like to share with the class what you're talking about? Obviously not, that's why I whispered. <gasps> Do you want me to tell you what I said to him? Yeah. I said mirrors don't lie, and lucky for you, they can't laugh either. <laughs> when I was a little girl, I was told if you made an ugly face, it would freeze and you'd be stuck like that. Well, you can't say you weren't warned. For today's assignment, you're gonna need a partner. But I'm gonna choose them. How can we keep our school clean? Timothy? By staying at home. Alright class, your question for today is what do you want to be when you're older? Let's start off with you, Olivia. I want to be a teacher just like you. Awesome! What about you, Tom? I want to be a mechanic. I can definitely see you doing that. And what about you, Emma? I want to be a rich and famous model and actress. Wow, good for you. And you, Jesse? Jesse? What do you want to do when you're older? I want to marry Emma. <gasps> Does anyone know of a bird that has wings but can't fly? Yeah, I know. Okay, tell us. A dead one. Class, what do we call people that steal? Robbers. Good, now what do we call people who keep talking when we're no longer interested? Teachers. <gasps> I recently became a mom. Congratulations, teacher. But my baby keeps crying and won't fall asleep. Do you know how I can make her fall asleep? Yeah, that's easy. How? When you teach us in class, make her sit on a chair and she'll automatically fall asleep. Luke, where's your homework? I'm really sorry, I don't have it here. How come? I ate my worksheets. What? Why would you do such a thing? Because my dog refused to. Okay class, we're gonna start by sharing our dream. What's yours, Luke? My dream is to earn a million dollars per year like my dad. Wow, your dad earns that much? No, that's also my dad's dream. <laughs> Tell me the comparative degree of bad. Badder? What? Water? Stop. Stopper? <laughs> class, today we're gonna talk about tenses. For example, if I say I am beautiful, what tense is it in? Well, it's obviously the past tense. <gasps> oh, I guess that's all the time we have for today's class. Have a good night, everyone. You forgot to give us homework. Luke, give me a sentence starting with I. 
I is... No, always start with I am. Alright, I am the ninth letter of the alphabet. <laughs> Why are you late? There was a man who lost a $100 bill. That's nice, were you helping him look for it? No, I was standing on it. WHAT?! Should I get in trouble for something that I didn't even do? No. Good, because I didn't do the homework. Alright, has everyone copied this down? No, not yet. Yes. Okay. Luke, can I speak with you privately for a second? Yep, just one second. So I wanted to talk to you because you're failing this class. <laughs> you have a 37% and you're missing four assignments. Shh. No, I should get it because I always get 100%. But I've never skipped a day of class. What are you two arguing about? We found this $20 bill and decided to give it to whoever could tell the biggest lie. <sighs> you should be ashamed of yourself. When I was your age, I didn't even know what a lie was. Ah, uh, you win. <gasps> Can you see God? No. Can you touch God? No. Then there isn't a God. Ma'am, can you see your brain? No. Can you touch your brain? No. Oh, so you don't have a brain? <gasps> Kaden, you got 55% on the test. <laughs> Which is the highest of everyone in the class. <gasps> if a thousand kilograms equals a ton, what about 3,000 kilograms? Oh, I know it, teacher! Okay, go on. Ton, ton, ton. <gasps> we have a substitute. Come sit beside me, but I'll get in trouble. She won't even know. <sighs> okay. Good morning, class. My name is Mrs. Spatula, and I'm going to be your substitute for the day. <laughs> Mrs. Spatula? What's so funny, boys? <laughs> no nothing, miss. What's your name? I'm going to do attendance. My name is Ben. Last name? D Dover. Thank you there, Mr. Ben Dover. <laughs> What's so funny? If I gave you two cats, and another two cats, and another two cats, how many would you have? Seven. No, listen carefully. If I gave you two cats, and another two cats, and another two cats, how many would you have? Seven. Let me put it to you differently. If I gave you two apples, and another two apples, and another two apples, how many would you have? Six. Good. Now if I gave you two cats, and another two cats, and another two cats, how many would you have? Seven. Johnny, where in the heck do you get seven from? Because I already have a cat! <laughs> Kids, what does the chicken give you? Meat! Very good. Now what does the pig give you? Bacon! Great! And what does the fat cow give you? Homework! <laughs> Hi Luke, it's your teacher. Can I speak to your parents? Uh, my parents aren't home. Well, could I leave them a message? Sorry, we don't have an answering machine. <gasps> Why are you late? Because of a sign down the road. What sign? This sign. Sorry guys, it looks like we won't be watching a movie today. I can't get it to load. Miss, can I try something? Yeah, go ahead. class, as you guys could probably tell, we're going to be watching a movie today. But before we start, I'm going to hand out the worksheet for it. What comes after five? Six, seven. Good! You're an intelligent young boy. What comes after six, seven? Eight, nine, ten. Excellent! And what comes after eight, nine, ten? Jack, queen, king. Timmy, how do you spell crocodile? K-R-O-K-O-D-A-I-L. No, that's wrong. Maybe it's wrong, but you asked how I spell it! What's two flowers plus two flowers? Four flowers? 
Very good. Now it's 2,563 flowers plus 8,922 flowers. A garden? <laughs> Did you finish the last question? Yeah? Why? Can you show me how to do it? I don't get it. <sighs> it's too hard to explain. Here, just copy my answer. Okay, thanks. Wait, what does this word say? And this word? And this word? Um, I don't know. How do you not know? You're the one who wrote it. Class, you have two minutes until you have to hand in the assignment. <sighs> Whatever, I'll just put scribbles for the words I can't read so he thinks I know the answer. Luke, can you come here for a second? What do you need, sir? I can't read this answer, so can you just explain it to me so I can still give you the mark? Whoever answers my question can go home. Who threw this pencil? Me, and I'm going home. <gasps> Boys, what's so funny? <laughs> Nothing now. Next time I hear laughing, I'm gonna give the whole class a new seating plan, okay? Now, back to what I was saying. In the Pythagorean theorem, A squared... I was running through the six <laughs> with my woes. always gonna be the smallest sides, and yeah. C squared is the hypotenuse, which is the longest side. <laughs> <laughs> name five animals that live in water. Frog? Very good. Now name the other four animals. His mother, his father, his sister, and his brother. Class, I'm gonna quickly go to the bathroom and I don't want to hear a single noise, okay? I'll be back in a few seconds. I dare you to go sit on the teacher's chair. What? What? Are you a scaredy cat? No? <sighs> Fine. <laughs> Everyone be quiet, the teacher's coming! Five, right? No, you idiot! I'm gonna tell the teacher you swore at me! No, no, no! Please don't do it! What is it, Caden? May I go to the bathroom, please? Ah, uh, what is the answer? <sighs> Whatever, I'll just put something random. <sighs> Here you go, Mr. Lou. Thank you, Luke. Now you can go sit down and relax for the rest of the class. Sounds good. <laughs> it looks like he's going golfing. Pretend like you're working. Why are you guys laughing? Oh, um, Luke told me a funny joke. Oh yeah? What was the joke? Um, why did the chicken cross the road? To get to the other side. <laughs> I'll let you guys continue your work. <laughs> Whoever gets this next question right gets a candy. What's 11 plus 11? <gasps> 22! Can someone give me examples of useless things? Good, any other examples? <gasps> if you had $5 and asked your mother for another $5, how much money would you have? I would have five dollars, miss. You don't know your math. But miss, you don't know my mother. <laughs> Alright class, I'm gonna do attendance now. Okay Luke, come on, you can do this. All you have to do is say here. Don't yell it, don't whisper, just talk normally and say here. Charlie? Here. Addison? Hey y'all! Bryce? Yep. Noah? I'm here. Luke? All right, two plus two equals? Four. Four, thank you. And today we're gonna to be starting a new unit, so I'm gonna write... And that's how you solve the questions in this new unit. Does anyone have any questions? So your teacher left me with the assignment that you guys have to work on today. It says you have to write an essay about yourself, and I'm gonna tape this on the wall if you guys wanna take a look. Why don't we finish as fast as possible so we can go play on the computers? <gasps> that's a good idea! We're done. Well done, boys. Keep those somewhere safe so you can give them to Mr. Luke tomorrow. Now you guys can play on the computers for the rest of the class. Yes! Let's go, baby! Good morning, class. You guys can continue working on the assignment from yesterday. Let's go hand them in. Yes, boys? We're done. You're done already? This isn't what you're supposed to do! What do you mean? 
You were supposed to write an essay about someone else. What? Now go redo it. What the heck? That's not what the instructions said. Hmm. Oh, look, he's going to go read them. <gasps> Class, can someone tell me what cows drink? What do cows drink? <gasps> I know it, I know it, I know it. Come on, teacher, please pick me. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, Jesse, do you know? Um, milk? Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. No, it's a trick question. They actually drink water. Who can come up and solve this question? Hey man, there's something dirty under your arm. Where? Great, come up and solve it. <gasps> Alright class, I'm gonna do attendance now. Okay Luke, come on, you can do this. All you have to do is say here. Don't yell it, don't whisper, just talk normally and say here. Charlie? Here? Addison? Hey y'all! Bryce? Yep. Noah? I'm here. Luke? Here! Can you write 55 for me? How do I do that? Write 5 and beside it write another 5. What are you waiting for? I don't know which side to write the other 5. Do you know the difference between right and wrong? Yes, I do. Alright, if I reached into a man's pocket and took his wallet with all his money, what would I be? You'd be his wife. <laughs> do you all understand how to use longitude, latitude, and degrees now? Yeah. So what if I asked you to meet me for lunch at 55 degrees, 6 minutes north latitude, and 72 degrees, 8 minutes east longitude? You'd be eating by yourself. <laughs> so is the answer A or B? A. A. B. <laughs> How could you get that wrong? Actually, he's right. The answer is B. May I use the bathroom? As long as you can tell me the alphabet. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, Q, R, S, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Where is P? Running down my leg. I just want to remind everyone to make sure you read the questions right. I can't figure out the answer to this question. Which one? Number seven. What's the hardest natural substance on earth? Oh, so out of all the natural substances on earth, which one's the hardest? I don't know what a natural substance is though. Uh, do you play Minecraft? Yeah. What's the hardest natural substance in the game? Uh, diamonds? Maybe. I don't know. Our principal's an idiot. Do you know who I am? No. I'm his daughter. Do you know who I am? No. Good. <laughs> Today we're going to be doing a review for tomorrow's test. So here's an example of what the questions are going to look like. So, if we have two on this side and two on this side and we combine the two, that equals one, two, three... Four. Thank you, Mrs. P. What? I got 562.9, and the answers are either 2, 25, 13, or 27. It must be 27, because it's the closest to 562.9. Oh my god, I want banana. Oh. No work. <gasps> Wait, I'm Jenny. Oh my god, oh my god, banana. Okay class, hand in your test if you haven't already. Here you go, miss. Thank you, Luke. Have a great weekend. Thanks, you too. That test wasn't even hard. What took you so long? I got stuck on the back of the page. On the what? The back of the page. Hello darkness, my old friend.
Now we're gonna go over some questions related to the book we just read. So the first question- So who do you like again? I have a big crush on Molly. Can anyone tell me why the teacher in the book was wearing sunglasses to school? Because she had bright students. <laughs> because she had bright students! <laughs> oh, Jesse, you're quite the kid. Bing bong! Oh, I guess that's all the time we have for today's class. I'll see you guys tomorrow. What does it say? We should go out sometime. You're so funny. Here's my number. Hey, hey, Luke! Who wants to come up and draw a diagram of bacteria? If no one volunteers, I'm gonna have to pick someone. Luke, can you come up and show us how to draw a diagram of bacteria? <sighs> Here it is, ma'am. Where? You haven't drawn anything. Ma'am, you won't be able to see bacteria without a microscope. <laughs> Alright class, I'm just stepping out to use the bathroom, but remember, you guys are writing a test, so please be quiet, okay? Okay! I'll only be a couple seconds. Alright class, I'll be right back. Remember, you guys are writing a test, so do not make a single noise. What's the answer to number one? Mom, I love you. Aww, I love you too, honey. Mom, have I ever told you that I love you? <sighs> yes, what do you want? Honey, what did you get on your test? I got 79%. Luke, what'd you get on your exam? I got 51%. Start writing this in your notes. Can I go to the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? So what did you need help with? I'm not going to teach you this because you'll learn it next year. I'm going to skip this because you guys should remember it from last year. How much is half of eight? Up and down or across? What do you mean? Well, up and down makes three and across the middle leaves a zero. <laughs> Luke, what's 1 minus 1? 1 minus 1? Yeah, if you subtract 1 from 1, what do you get? 1! No, try again. 2? Okay, let's do it this way. If you have only one potato chip left in the frying pan and you take it out of the pan... Oh, I know the answer! You do? What is it then? Cooking oil! <gasps> Pay attention! I am paying attention, ma'am! Oh really? What's the last thing I said? The last thing you said is pay attention. <laughs> Can anyone tell me what the name of the cat was in this book? Oh, I know it, I know it, I know it! Luke? Maury. Sorry, what was that? Maury. Just one more time? Maury. Rory, yep, that's correct. Alright, what other questions can I ask you guys? Jack decided to climb up the beanstalk because he didn't know what he would find. Excuse me, Olivia? What do you have to say for yourself? What? It wasn't me! Mm-hmm. That's what they all say. They're talking so loud I can't even hear the teacher. Excuse me, I can't hear. This is a private conversation you're not supposed to hear. The first question is going to be pretty basic just to see who's paying attention, but it's what is 5 plus 2? Luke? Hmm? Can you answer my question, or are you not paying attention? Oh, uh, seven. No, you need to pay more attention. That is correct. Hi, is this the Stop Taking Things Too Literally course? Yes, it is. Please take a seat. All right, thanks. Sorry about that. Today, we're going to be starting our new unit on algebra. Why do we have to learn this? We're never even going to use this in life. Do you know what the speed limit is? No idea. Oh, there's a sign coming up. Where? Oh. On a scale of 1 to 10, how attractive am I? 10? 
Can you move for me? No, you have please. To... No, move, move. Why? Please. Why are you so weird? Please, about? come on, please. It's weird. Please. Ah, move. <sighs> on a scale of one to ten, how attractive am I? Mm, like a solid three. So you would kiss me? Mm, I don't know. We're in a hot tub. Uh, maybe not today. Okay. Thanks.